Dusty, we were supposed to have a meeting this morning. Don't you think it would be wise to discuss your defense? Why? What's the point? Uh, you're charged for attempted murder. Dusty, you could go to jail for a long time, so why are you acting like this is not some big deal? I mean, I know, I know, you never intended for anyone to get hurt, but Paul Ryan is seriously injured because of a bomb that you put in that warehouse. He could have been killed along with Meg and Damien. Nobody died. Paul's going to be fine. Which is lucky for you. Look, I found some evidence to prove that there were extenuating circumstances. I think the jury's going to have to take that to an, into account because of your mental state. But look, we have to be on the same page here. Forget it. I've decided to plead guilty. Dusty, you would be a total fool to plead guilty. Men of my mind. Why? Why? I mean, the jury, there's a, there's a really great chance that the jury is going to be on our side. Look, you were deliberately provoked, and you responded. You never intended to cause harm to Paul. I mean, if we play our cards right, Dusty, there's a good chance we might even get a dismissal. It's not going to happen. Why are you so hell-bent on doing hard time in jail? You're just crazy. Maybe. Okay. Okay. What if you, what if you do 10 to 15 for attempted murder? By the time you get out, Johnny's going to be all grown up. Is that what you want, Dusty? I don't see him that much anyway. Craig's in charge of his life. That's not going to change. Okay, look. I know you feel like hell right now, but I am too good of a lawyer to stand by and watch you ruin your life, Dusty. I'm not letting you plead guilty. You're fired. There's... Great life. Fired you, can't you take a hand? I'm not letting you fire me. Well, you're not getting paid, so don't bother yourself. This is not about the money, Dusty, and you know it. What's it about? Okay. I know you don't like the way Meg has been treating you. She has hung you out to dry, and she has sided with Damien. And is you're just angry about that. Wants. I don't care. No, that's what you say, Dusty. But you think she picked the wrong side, and she should have chosen better. I've given up on Meg. No. Oh. Now you want to fight back. Nope, I'm tired of fighting. What, do you want to ru ruin your life? It's my life. You don't ever say. What the hell is wrong with you? I don't give a damn anymore. Well, I do. Why? I don't know why I do, but I do. Do you have a problem with that? What was that for? Supposed to be a wake up call, snap you out of your pathetic, self pitying funk. So it was a mercy kiss. Well, I mean, I could have hit you upside the head, but I thought you'd enjoy kissing me more. <laughs> You're wasting your time. Who says? I do. I'm a mess. You deserve better. Who says? He says you always have to come and save the day. You know, why can't the damsel, you know, save the white knight? Because it doesn't work. It works for me. Come on, I'm all about equal rights. I'm pretty strong. I can just pull you up on my horse and we can gallop off into the sunset. No problem. Tempting offer. Why don't you give in to temptation, Dusty? I can handle that. I'm not sure I can. No, I just don't underestimate myself. Dusty? Bad time? No, no, it's fine. Hey, buddy. Hey, good to see you, Holden. Am I interrupting? No, you're not. It's okay. Yeah. You know what? I should go. I should. Take care. So you hire a new lawyer yet? No. Well, I'm keeping your files in case you change your mind. If you let me, Dusty, I really think I can help you. I guess I'm not used to a woman coming to my rescue. Yeah. You should try it. You might like it sometime. 
I'll take it into consideration, Counselor. 